A dangerous and illegal dive at Sunset Cliffs nearly killed two men. Our 10 News anchor Robert Santos says they would have drowned if not, if it wasn't for a stranger who just happened to be there at the right time. They thought they were strong swimmers until Mother Nature proved them wrong. From Sky 10, you can see a lifeguard putting a blanket around one of the victims. He managed to climb onto the rocks after strong waves tossed him around. Just moments before, he watched helplessly as his friend, this guy, kept getting pulled underwater. I heard this guy asking for help, 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 so I ran over here and uh, I saw the guy was drowning. He would have drowned if Juan Nunez did not react fast enough. I was trying to figure how to get him out and I remember I had a rope on my truck, so I ran over here. I just threw him the rope, but you know, he was sinking and sinking to and I told him just hold on. These guys are not the first to jump off these cliffs. Just look at all these YouTube videos posted by people drawn here by the excitement of cliff jumping. Sure, it's fun, but this sign warns that jumping or diving from the cliffs is prohibited and dangerous. These teens live to boast about their adventure, but today it was especially windy. The water cold and waves strong and rough, which made it tough for these guys to get out. I, I wasn't going to jump in there myself, so I got the rope and just threw it at him and just told him to hold on tight. Juan pulled him to safety and then stuck around to make sure he was okay as lifeguards lifted his friend to safety and then checked him out. Turns out both were okay and both were actually able to drive home. Juan, a landscaper, just happened to stop here on his break. You know, I was going to go somewhere else, and then I said, I'll just go over there and have lunch, you know, and I think God sent me here to save somebody. At Sunset Cliffs, Robert Santos, 10 News. All right, to go, Juan. All right, Memorial Day is just a couple of weeks away. Lifeguards expect this spot to be packed, too. They want to remind people, thinking about jumping, it is illegal. You can be fined up to $475. The two guys today got off with just a warning.